Hey guys, I collect each row here. Uh, I want to do a video for Yankee Cards, Jerome, for reaching uh, 200 subscribers. Quite the accomplishment. Uh, congratulations on that feat, man. That's uh, really awesome. Um, he wanted to do us to do a video on our top five Yankees cards. So in the backdrop, I got uh, some older players, some Hall of Famers, uh, all on-card autos, which I always prefer in the day of the sticker autograph. But uh, anytime I can pick some of these up at a decent price, I always like to uh, go for those. Um, okay, so first one, this is actually really tough, actually, um, to get the narrow it down to five. Um, I'm not a necessarily a Yankee collector, but with the uh, history of that team and the players they've had on it, it's hard not to... Uh, Appreciate the players that they've had in the the all the World Series they've uh, um, gotten in their uh, history. So the first card I want to start off with is this Joe DiMaggio, Topps Marquee Jersey Relic, number to ninety nine. Really cool, nice big swatch of the jersey with the pinstripe and part of the pinstripe stripe at the bottom. These are pretty rare. You don't really see these come up that often. Number four. I'm going to do this SP Legendary Cuts Historic Lumber. Um, number to 75. A piece of Babe Ruth's Bat. Really cool hollow foil on there. It's a great looking card. Got a lot of shine to it. Looks really cool. And uh, when Nate tops 85401 and Titanic Taters, um, Eric, they were talking about um, the authentic authenticity of some of these cards, of what's actually in the card. And on this one, it says, you know, the front of this card is an authentic piece of a bat used by Babe Ruth in an official Major League game. So it's a really cool piece. I th believe it's my only uh, Babe Ruth relic. So. Really cool to add that. That's number four. Um, number three. I'm do this upper uh, upper deck premier legendary remnants Lou Gehrig jersey. And we got a little piece of the uh, pinstripe there, pretty faded. And over here, some kind of stain of some kind. So really cool piece. Um, Pulled this out of a out of a box. I remember on the front of the box they had you know they always give you a glimpse of a card or cards you can pull from the product, and this was on the front of the box. Not the exact one, of course, but uh, it was really cool. And again, this has kind of the same uh, same authentication on the back. Received a game game used baseball card on the front of this card. Uh, pieces of memorabilia that have been certified to us as being used in an official Major League bait baseball game so really cool and I uh, hand pulled that one so got very lucky number two be this um, pinstripe exclusive dual um, jersey Mickey Mantle and Joe DiMaggio really cool like the you really tell these are old more of the flannel, the gray flannel there. A nice piece of pinstripe from Mickey Mantle there. Perforated. And this one is uh, numbered to 50. The same thing with the authentication on the back of this. Both of them worn in Major League Baseball games from both players. So, really cool card. And final. Number number one is this Derek Jeter uh, draft pick 92 front row, and this is the autograph version. It's been authenticated by JSA through Beckett. It's a really cool card, very early autograph of Derek Jeter. You see on there, it's, it's changed quite a bit over the years. And these are numbered to 500. So really cool. I like getting the early stuff with the guys, even if it's not a, a true Major League Baseball card. Have an early autograph of a player. Um, I, re I really like those. So that's it, guys. That's my top five and that I narrowed down to. 
Um, thanks again for the contest, uh, Jerome. And again, congratulations on reaching 200 subs. Thanks, guys. Have a good night.